The museum has been telling stories about witches and witchcraft since the 1960s. Witches and witchcraft are a very well-known but perhaps lesser understood aspect of life on the North York Moors. Tales of witches and witchcraft are embedded within the North York Moors as they are across the UK and throughout the world. They give us an insight into the social values of the time and place when they were told. Our ancestors turned to the figure of the witch to explain what was going on in the community. For example, milk that wouldn't churn into butter, an illness of an animal, or even hailstorms that would destroy the crops. One of the most well-known witch figures across the North York Moors is Nanny Pearson. And she's actually one of three generations of Nanny Pearsons. One of the older Nanny Pearsons is associated with the witch hair tale where the witch will transform into a hare. But the most modern version of the Nanny Pearson tale is a tale told by a lady in the early 19th century about Nanny Pearson who could make herself very, very tiny and run about in her crockery cupboard. These four spell tokens date from the early to mid 18th century. The hearts, initials and dates suggest that they are love charms. These appear to emerge from a particular tradition of ritualistic magic, which in this case was peculiar to women. There were also items of transactional magic, so the person who made them was doing so in order to make a living. 